Ta-da! Hello everybody, good afternoon. Welcome to Butterfly Square Garden, a sanctuary and a protection, home, safe space, whatever you want to call it, for butterflies. And if you've been following us for a little bit, we hung up a whole bunch of chrysalises together, that's what's over here, and then every single morning, as the caterpillars, uh, I mean, as, as the butterflies come out, I move them into this enclosure. So, you know, every day I've been adding more and we're about at capacity. That's, I would say, I finally moved the camera so you guys can see more of what's going on in the enclosure. So, I don't know if you guys, you can go back and check the video that we did last time where we set up the butterfly feeder and one of the butterflies immediately started feeding so that was really good news because ever since then I've been watching them drink every single day uh, and I have a water bottle over here and I'll take it and I'll just give a little you know spritz in there and I'll give the plant a little split spritz so that there's water and they can stay hydrated but the main thing is that they're drinking the Gatorade uh, which is has all the sugar and salts that they need to pass on their genes and that's what I've been talking about is the next step is right here this is called burdock which isn't necessarily specifically the painted ladies host plant they are known as the thistle butterfly but uh, that's that's pretty much completing the life cycle I mean if you can look really closely where is it on this one right where my finger was all of those little white dots I don't know you people on your cell phones might be hard to see um, I just scared all of the butterflies away but you can see oops I'm pointing to the wrong thing mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you can see they're actually on the underside of the leaf that's where they like to go the most but I tried to get a good close-up of the butterflies with my phone um, on the plants but as I guess I didn't do <laughs> a very good job I worked so hard to set this up most of the butterflies are up top that's where the window is letting the light in and they like to sun sunbathe if they're hungry or thirsty they can drink the Gatorade from from the feeder down there I'll show you that with a close-up in a second is there anything else I want to say I mean the last time I wanted to show you a better zoom out so that's what I did with the the webcam and then I've got my phone trying to get a close-up ooh you know what I'm just gonna show you guys because they're actually starting to lay eggs and I was thinking about it I mean like if they're like chickens or whatever it's probably uncomfortable to be so full of eggs and it's probably a relief to finally be like able to lay their eggs on something so let me get a better view on my own phone uh, that's what that butterfly is doing right now it's pressing its little butt oop yep and he just finished so that's what they do they they uh, stick they have some sort of sticky substance and see so you can see on this on this leaf it's really hard to get a good close-up because the phone goes out of close it focus um, they're really 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 small see they have really small eggs and they can lay a lot so every single day they're laying eggs and every single night they will mate and they'll pair up so isn't that interesting I just really like butterflies these are painted ladies once again and as much as I love them my focus is going to be moving towards monarchs I know that the monarchs are endangered and painted ladies are like the most common butterfly in the world so we're kind of going from one to the other but there's really not much difference in taking care of them. Uh, monarchs, I know, they're bigger, and they, the, I mean, I did take care of them last year, 
Last year I had swallowtails like this, and then I also had monarchs like this. So monarchs like milkweed, and the swallowtails I found on my dill. The painted ladies, which are these, I three generations ago I got a couple caterpillars in the mail, and ever since then I've just been breeding my own. So down here is anyone oop there he is let's try to get a good view this butterfly is looking for food and he found it yay so that's proof um they go hog like they go to town look how excited he is that he found the food so can i can't really get any closer without losing focus but once again um so i got i showed you guys the butterflies laying the egg and now this one is feeding and as you can see once he finds the nectar they drink for a, a pretty long time like if i were to just show you him drinking it gets a little boring but uh maybe you can watch i'll talk about the other butterflies um up oh, looks like he's done you know like they're curious they want to look around isn't that so cute Oh, I hope I didn't, no, didn't squish anyone. You always got to be careful. You can move like, I've got these rocks and stuff and, you know, there's paper and everything. That guy's drinking around the pencil, the pen, I mean. Haha. <laughs> oh, look, he, there's more. They're drinking there. Um, He's got his back to us, but he's drinking right now. Um, Is there anything else that I really wanted? It's just like a quick video. I wanted to do a check-in. These are the, that's the back end, and this is, ooh. This is more, wow, you can really see a lot when I stood up. Um, ba -ba -da 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 -da. I'm trying to get a whole bunch of good angles for you guys, but it's not so easy. <laughs> wow, butterflies. If you like butterflies and you know it, clap your hands. Ha 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 ha. If I were to go to the mesh, oop, I scared him. It's so funny because when they're not doing anything, they're just like standing around and you're like, oh, you know, the butterflies, they're boring. They're not really doing anything. But then you, you'll be not thinking and casually just walk up to them a little bit too fast and all of them will flutter at the same time and they'll all fall down and then fly around. So that's cute. Is there anything else that I didn't show you guys on this video? I didn't show you any of them actually mating. Like, if I were to look, is there anyone trying to mate right now? There's no one trying to mate right this second. Otherwise, I would show you. That's they they start doing that more like after five after five o'clock maybe that's when they start. Oh, see you can't you can't see them very well if I do that, but yep, 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 yep. Butterflies are just really fun animals to have, and if you learn how to take care of them, you know, it's a joy. But if you can't. If you can't take care of them, they're just going to die. And if they're just going to die, you might as well just let them go. Outside. So I guess this is just going to be like a 10-minute video. Huh? How exciting. Uh, I don't know. I just felt like checking in with you guys um, since I have the butterflies and I'm looking at them every day. I just like to share... It must be fun to be underneath a leaf. Like, if I if I could climb a tree and the leaf was as big as my car, um, and I can just munch on it all day long, and then I just kept getting bigger, like, that would be fun. And that's what they do. So, la, 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 la. Yep, this guy's sticking his butt up. They have just really, 
specific behavior. Um, oh, come on. He was flapping so good, and then he stopped. Oop. Ugh. When I turned away, he, he was doing it. Um, there he goes. So, yeah. They have just really specific behavior. You know, kind of like how all dogs act one way and all cats act the other way. Butterflies act a certain way, too. And... It's been a really fun time getting to know them better because, once again, when I started this whole biz, the whole purpose was because there weren't enough butterflies in the world. You know, there were butterflies, and then all of a sudden, where are all the butterflies? So I kind of just uh, felt involved, you know. They came to me, and now I take care of them I have a sanctuary well it's not mine it's ours so if anyone wants to donate we've got a PayPal I'm working on making a patreon because that's what everyone does these days is anyone drinking there's a guy drinking back there uh, so I think maybe I'm gonna make a, a video of, of some close-ups now that they know how to work the station I can do um, a video and add some music and then we can do more of this stuff and you guys don't have to hear me talking the whole time and it can be a fun little thing so yep happy planting make sure you plant lots of plants if you want to get involved with butterflies plant some plants um, plant some burdock that's what this is it's like a root it's like imagine a carrot that grew big giant leaves. That's what this is. Um, what else? Milkweed is good for... Oh, we found it. I got him. Milkweed is good for monarch butterflies. And if you want to attract swallowtails... Once again, I really like swallowtails. They were my first, first, first butterflies. Um, plant some rue or some dill or some parsley. Oops, I almost knocked everything over. Don't you just love when that happens? Do, 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 do. There's just so many that it's like there's always something happening. It's like an anthill. You know how you, you go to an anthill and it's always so busy? That's kind of what it feels like when you take care of this many butterflies and caterpillars, but uh, I got to clean them out, so I'm not going to show you them right now. So once again, like you can see there's about a million eggs, and I literally just put it into in, in this morning, and it's because I saw them laying eggs on the, around the pen, and I'm like, oh God, they're laying eggs whether I, I'm ready for them or not. So, uh, I luckily I was ready for them. You know, we've been growing these plants all winter long. So, they're in cups and I grew them from seed. And, yep, yep, yep. Do, 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 do. I don't know. I feel like, what was I just saying? Um, <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'll see you guys. Oh, yeah. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to show you them actually laying the eggs, which... Yeah, I showed you before. And, you know, now that there actually are eggs on the plant, there's something to show you. So, you know, I told you I'd put the plant in there, and now I just showed you there is a plant in there. And I showed you them drinking the food. So, I guess the next thing... Oop, there's a wire. <laughs> the next thing is to show you guys... Oop, there's the... Can I get him laying an egg? Oh, goodness. See, I totally forgot that these are living creatures, and I scared them all. Uh, well, anyways, he's not laying the egg anymore. So this is the life of a butterfly farmer or a butterfly breeder or a butterfly rescuer, butterfly sanctuary. You know, oh, look, you can see the light. Isn't that cool? Do, 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 do. Yep, I do kids parties. <laughs> Just kidding. And um, weddings, too. So... The only trouble right now is keeping the mesh clean because um, that's not Gatorade. That's actually a fluid that they eject 
when they're done, um, when they're coming out of their metamorphosis. So that's why it's a mess. You know, I try to wait a day, but, you know, sometimes they're just not done. So, oop, feed, feed, feed. Don't you just love watching the butterflies feeding? I do. Do, 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 do. Oop, one landed on my finger. Yay. I'm holding a butterfly. How often do you guys hold butterflies? Do you want to hold a butterfly? Because come to my house and, you know, just pick one up off the butterfly feeder. I do have, ooh, um, there is one within my reach, so I'm going to grab it and talk about it. Ta-da! That's a hummingbird feeder. Oops. And this is a ring hummingbird feeder. And I'm like, if I can train them to use a hummingbird feeder over there, then I can train them to use this, and then they'll actually fly up to your, my finger and feed off of my finger. Wouldn't that be fun, everybody? So that's kind of, that's the next thing. Um, I should have started with that. So I guess that's what I'll show you the next video is I'll, I'll let you know if that works or not because I've got lots and lots of ideas because these guys, you know, it's out of necessity. They're, they just, they, they need, they have a lot of needs and it's my job to meet their needs. So if there's any parents out there who've ever taken care of kids, you know, you do things that you never thought you could do because you have to, you know, they ask you to by being needy. <laughs> so, yeah, that's just a lot of fun. We're just having fun together. I'm like, do I show you them feeding? I'm still waiting for a really good shot of them laying eggs. Um, I didn't get the best shot, but I did get a shot of them laying eggs, and you got to see some of the eggs. So that's the end of that. Um, some more drinking footage. <laughs> it's just so cute. I just love them so much. All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and again, happy plant. Oh, that's kind of how I was ending it. Happy planting, because if you want any of this, every time I'm going to end a video, I feel like they're going to, oh, man. Every time I end a video, he starts freaking laying an egg again. There he goes. Go for it. Go for it. I want to end the video on, like, a really good egg lay. Hmm, 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 hmm. They're like, Jason, I'm going to do it perfectly out of view. He turned around, and he just did it out of view. Thank you, little little guy. Do it again. Someone, oop, there he goes. Bop. Yep, and that's what it looks like. It just takes, you know, three seconds, and that's the end of that, so... Haha, <laughs> and I'm showing you every time I'm going to end the footage, they they start drinking at the feeder again. And it's just so much fun to watch. If I love watching them feed this much, I mean, you guys must too. So, yeah, I should end the video and I will I will hook up the live stream of them feeding because this is it. You know, I freaking worked for months to set this up so, so that I could do a live stream. I mean, as much as I like vlogging. The purpose was to do a live stream of them feeding and have some fun music and it'll be like a dance party in the background for while you're studying or something and you know you can just have the butterflies in in your life without me talking and talking and talking and talking but this is a little diary so for the millionth time i love you guys and happy planting get planting oop shit fucking I almost squished, I almost squished my little baby. Damn, are you dead? Nope, it's still alive. Um, don't end a video without realizing that the butterflies... This was the first video, first butterfly, um, since, again, talking about it. 
This is the first butterfly in the video that was drinking at the little fountain thingy over here. So get off my finger so I can end the video, please. Okay. I want more butterflies in the world, so it's kind of hard for me to do all the planting on my own. So like get the planting so that we can all share the workload and then we can all benefit and the kids will get some butterflies. So all the dogs and the old people and you, so, and me. Um, okay, bye. See you guys next time.